test track. Guess that he was making out with boys in the park. Okay guys, I must like you a lot because I just turned my fan off to turn this ring light to film this video. Without further ado, let's do the reaction to Olivia O'Brien's Guts. I pay attention to things that most people ignore. I love her lyricism so much. It's very unique. And I feel like I love the way she switches from you know chest to head voice all the time she's got such a beautiful falsetto that it works like it doesn't you know distract you when she does it it just kind of elevates the song and makes it feel a bit more lighter no pun intended light as a feather you know the Okay, where are we going with this album? I can totally see this in a movie, like kind of towards, um, like a, the the moment two people fall in love. I don't know, or like even the ending. I think that's Olivia O'Brien's signature, where she like builds up, builds up, builds up, builds up, and then just drops it. And I feel like that's really become a staple of her music, like especially like the singles at least like they all have that huge little build up and then it's just a drop and it goes la, 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 la. you know period bad idea right come on hey who knows this part haven't heard for you in a couple of months and i'm sensing some undertones my brain goes up. Uh, I should probably, probably not see you tonight. It's a bad idea, right? But I really can't remember when my brain goes up. Uh, yes, I know that he's my ex, but I really like I'm really tired of him today. The ending kind of feels like a summer outro for like a teens movie, you get what I mean? Vampire. Of course we all know this one. Hey to give the satisfaction, asking how you doing now, cool guy, you got it. Six months of torture, you sold it, some forbidden paradise, I loved you truly. Cause I've made some real big mistakes, Take the words one look fine. I used to think I was smart, you made me look. You stole me for pies, and you sunk your teeth in and every girl I ever talked to told me you were bad, bad. God, I hate the way I call them crazy too. You're so convincing. God knows I never went for me and not her. Right? Big mistake. Bleed me dry like a goddamn vampire. You said it was true love, but wouldn't that be hard? I tried to help you out, now I know that I can't Give me try like a goddamn vampire that outro like for real feels like my skin didn't fit right over my bones i feel that girl i stumbled over all my words i made it weird i made it worse Finally, something that speaks to my core. Conversation on the website. Talk to the top guy. Swore it was his type. Guess that he was making out with boys in the park. Every guy like his gay. He must have been making out with boys in the park. 
Making the bed. You made your bed, now lay in it. Another thing I ruined, I used to do for fun. Oh, it so makes me want to cry Hey, the bed is so loud in my head The color is stronger No, I didn't get you out if I tried with you This feels like favorite crimes, cousin sister So good at conveying emotions in her songs. Like you can hear this like distaste now, you know? Like it's really like, ah, uh, like why? Like you can feel that emotion. And I love when artists do that. I mean, she is also an actress, but like I just love it and I appreciate it. <laughs> Cause I miss the way he kisses and the way he made me laugh, yeah. Kiss this face, bring it up. This one definitely could grow on me. The grudge. Fitting. If nightmares each week about that Friday and May angers, and I doubt you ever think about the damage that you did, but I It takes time to forgive, but I don't feel strong. That line yeah, I'm so tough when I'm alone, alone and I make, you, make feel you feel so guilty. Yeah. Both drew blood, but man, those cuts were never equal. And I don't Could anybody do the things you did so easily? If you guys haven't already listened to Lauren Simarelli's, um album, Please Stop Breaking My Heart, check that out because it's very, it's reminding me a lot of that and ended up at Arkansas is one of my favourite songs, so make sure you check that one out as well. Pretty isn't pretty, pretty isn't pretty, pretty, pretty isn't pretty. Trying to cover up. Trying to eat cake on birthday. That's actually me. I can hear it in a movie as well. Teenage Dream. Ooh, that's a big title. I really feel that line because I'm I've just turned 21 and I feel like sometimes people say oh my god you're so wise beyond your years you're so like mature for your age like have fun do all of these things like you still got time and all of this stuff but it kind of makes you fear like have I peaked already because everyone's already giving me the validation that I've made it before I've even accepted it, that I've made it myself, you know, because I mean, for me, I've booked my first commercial and I've acting is something that I'm working towards and even music. I wrote a song yesterday that I'm obsessed with that might be putting out um, soon, but um, it's not like the end for me, you know, there's still so much that I want to do, still so many legacies I want to create. But it's annoying when people just think 
wow, you've done it all at 19. Like, you can just sit back. Like, bitch, I've got so much more to do, period. <laughs> That was Guts by Olivia Rodrigo. It was an incredible album and it definitely was a perfect fit in her discography being the second album after the incredible Sour. Now, if you guys don't know, I have reacted to Sour. I've also done a song along to Driver's License, so you can check that out, and Vampire. So I'll link it all in the description below and on the screen over here. But make sure you check that out. Olivia is a superstar in the making and honestly she's she she hasn't reached her full potential yet you know because with age like she says it will get better Olivia and I do assure you that because bitch I'm 21 and it's only up from here but you know like do it for the story take risks have fun that's what I think I just heard someone say that recently, like, do it for the story. Do it for your story. Like, have fun. Because why not? You only live this life once. Anyways, that's it for me, guys. Check out my brand new film, Gear a Blessing in Disguise. If you want to check out my other reaction videos, I've done a whole bunch. I'll put a playlist on screen right now. Click on that, and I will see you guys back with a brand new video. Bye, guys. Great things are always to come.